It's okay. I'll take care of it. Okay, let's do this. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. Oh, this could have been Clementine if I hadn't found her when I did. Uh, I'm sorry. Gotta save the ammo. I'm sorry. Oh, God. We should bury him. I'll take care of it. Well, at least we're recycling. Oh, God. I have a feeling this is going to be a very depressing episode. At least he gets buried next to his puppy. I still wonder what happened to his parents. You notice that the uh, color palette changed. I think this is a, oh fuck Hey hey Who are you? What the hell do you want from us? Lee, what's going on? I saw someone standing there by the fence. Watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Kenny? I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. 
We've stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. We only checked the house to make sure it's secure. We didn't really toss the place. We're low on food, water, meds, ammo. We should make sure there's nothing here we can use before we move out. Will you search it if you wanna? I'm done with this house. We came to this city to find a boat, and that's just what I'm gonna do. Maybe it's not such a bad idea to check the place one more- I said I'm done with this house! Damn, Kenny. You a dick. We can do both, Ben. You take one last look around the place. Grab anything that looks useful, while me and Kenny go down to the river to get us a boat. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Clem, honey, I, I think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. I need you to watch out for Omid and Krista. Help them get ready to move out. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know, it, it's just this once. Sometimes we all have to put aside what we want for the good of the group. Hey, don't worry. I'll be back before you know it, okay? Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Well... You're kind of, uh... <laughs> yeah. No offense, Ben, but I'd feel safer if you stayed here. How am I supposed to not take offense to that? What am I, a liability? I didn't say it. Great. Just great. Thanks a lot for the vote of confidence. Confidence is earned, Ben. And you've got a long way to go to earn yours back after some of the stuff you've pulled. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah, I feel you. Why do I always get stuck with Kenny? All the doors in this place have uh, something written on them. Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? About what? about what happened back there, in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean... River's right up ahead. God damn it. Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. hell is going on? I don't know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Good one. Hmm. Let's keep moving. Ninja stealth our way through these empty streets. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're. Oh my god. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. Are you sure about that? Doesn't look like it to me. 
We need to start thinking about a plan B. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Well, screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. You think he would have realized that a boat would be the first thing people would have tried during the outbreak? This one might still be salvageable. <laughs> Seriously? You got a better fucking idea? Don't sass me. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. What if I don't got 25 cents? <laughs> the hell? Looks like the whole city has been boarded up for all the good it did. Yeah, here are my 25 cents. It's an old cash register. Not much use these days. I'm going to come back to that, aren't I? An abandoned newsstand. What is this, man? What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. 